Audhu billahi mina shaitan irrajim bismillah rahman rahim Alhamdulillahi rabbil alameen wa salatu wa salamu ala sayyidah mursaleen Ashadu in la ilaha illallah wa dahu la sharika la Wa ashahadu enna muhammadan abduhu wa rasuluhu Allahumma salli Allah muhammad wa ali muhammad Amma ba'ad Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuhu to my Muslim brothers and sisters. Alhamdulillah for Islam. And alhamdulillah that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has allowed us another day, another moment, another present, this present right now that we're in to seek nearness to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Allahu Akbar. Allahu Akbar. Every second that you and I have, our breathing, our heart is beating, our mind is working, Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. You know, I never want to sit here and get caught up in the past, right? You know, a lot of times people suggest to me, they give me ideas, they tell me that of all the experiences that I've had and that I've been through, that, you know, I could just tell stories all day about being in prison, things that I've seen with my own eyes, you know what I'm saying, things that I've been through. I mean, I could take my shirt off and show you scars and I could show you where I've been hit and I could tell you about when I've done the hitting and, you know, I could do all that. You know what I'm saying? And maybe there will come a time when I am secure enough in my dean that I don't get caught up in any kind of like, you know, vaingloryism or feeling like I'm, you know, uh, somehow uh, validating and encouraging that kind of lifestyle because I'm not. See, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala made me a Muslim. And Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has said that anything that I did before taking my shahada and before faith has entered my heart is forgiven. So I don't want to bring up the past all the time and I don't want to keep throwing it in people's faces. But I will speak on certain things if it is going to validate the situation that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala can make you a Muslim. You're not too far gone. Wallahi, you are not too far gone. When Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala found me, I was in the closed custody unit, the restricted housing unit of a level four prison yard. You see what I'm saying? Getting three showers a week, one hour a day for rec, and if I was lucky, getting a visit through a non-contact. And Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala found me there. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala allowed faith to enter my heart there. You see what I'm saying? So I will never glorify the criminal behavior. I will never glorify the violence and the brutality that I lived, but I lived it. But I will if it comes down to a point that you and I need to have a conversation and you need somebody to relate to, holla at me, man, because Islam is the truth.